It is Veterans Day, a day to honor all military veterans and thank them for their service. Now, for the past 12 years, Freedom Honor Flight and UW Lacrosse Athletics have been doing so with an annual breakfast celebration. News 19's Roger Staffaroni was there and shares what was offered beyond just the bacon and eggs. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. A special breakfast at UW Lacrosse on this Veterans Day. Well, it, Veterans Day means where I can come out and enjoy, you know, the day with people that I served with and other people. It was more than just eggs, toast, and coffee. It was camaraderie, Army, Navy, Air Force, Marines, and the Coast Guard, all veterans. Just seeing the veterans, the smiles on their faces, and catching up with a few that have gone with us on flights. For one attendee, it was honoring a veteran who couldn't attend. Mary Yucatel was there for her mother, who served during the Vietnam War. I'm proud of my mother for her service and for all the veterans that are here today. And helping make it all happen, UWL student athletes. From setup to serving, to taking some time to sit down and talk with the vets. There were also members from the UW Lacrosse Eagles Battalion Army ROTC Color Guard. Yeah, I think it's incomprehensible. Um, the things that they did at our age, it's amazing to hear what they've accomplished, um, but I'm also so grateful for them and so grateful for the sacrifices that they've made. It's the 12th year of the Veterans Day Breakfast, a simple and heartfelt event, both a thank you and a way for all to remember those who served. Well, I feel honored about that. Really appreciate all the things I get. I think just recognizing veterans every day and not just on Veterans Day is a huge thing. Um, and just letting them know that they're always, they're always, we're always grateful for them um, and that they're not forgotten. At the 12th Annual Veterans Day Breakfast, Roger Staffaroni, WXOW News 19. And a special thank you to our News 19 veterans, Roger Staffaroni, who you heard from there, who served in the Navy, and Daybreak anchor Joe Minnie, an Air Force veteran. Thanks to all who served.